It's the final stretch of the America East season and basketball returns to the Sangha Center as 23-5 Vermont takes on 11-17 UMass Lowell. What's going on everybody? Alongside the former UMass Lowell captain Jim Bordoka, I'm DJ Sixsmith. Vermont has had a spectacular season. They've lost only five times. Jim, they've won 15 straight games that ties a program record. What has made this team so special this season? Well, they bring a lot of experience, they bring a lot of depth, and they have the best freshman in the conference. Well, when you look at UMass Lowell, it's been an up and down season for them. Jim, they only scored 19 points at the half after dropping 100 against Maine. In that game against Hartford, it goes to overtime. Devastating loss on the road. How does UMass Lowell bounce back here today? Well, they just have to turn the page. Next play is a saying in basketball that we use often. you got to learn to have a short memory. They have two games left, both in the Songus Arena. One went away from the most wins ever in the Division One level. Now these two teams already met this season. Let's take a look back at that because Jihad Thomas early on in that game got a little bit banged up. So you're gonna know he's got a little, a little extra something going here today. As we take a look here, check out Thomas, 10 and blue. And as this play continues on, Thomas whacked right in the face there. We'll take a second look. Josh Hurley, he got him right there in the face. And so for Thomas, personal motivation and for Anthony Lamb, Certainly some big time motivation to continue to prove he's the best freshman in the conference. Yeah, an absolute stud. I mean, he's next in a long line of great Vermont players. Big, strong kid with a high motor, very aggressive on the offensive end. Anthony Lamb, a finalist for Mr. Basketball in New York State, has been spectacular as a freshman. On the other side, we featured two players today for UMass Lowell. Ryan Jones coming off a career high, eight three-pointers in the loss against Hartford. And then, of course, Jihad Thomas, that triple-double against Maine two games ago. Yeah, they've kind of been a two-headed monster for the Riverhawks in the offense. End. Jones from the outside, Jihad, foul line extended into the paint. It's the rematch of Vermont and UMass Lowell. Can the Catamounts stay undefeated in America East? Find out next. You're watching college basketball on ESPN3. 